My dear children, you have called me your mother chief. It is an honor to me and a great honor to call you my children. Always keep up the honor of this honorable profession. I thank you. May I say our Heavenly Father thanks you for what you do. Florence Nightingale uh, is the founder of Modern Day Nursing and she laid the foundation for nursing and made it what it is today and without her we, we would not be here and she is our inspiration. She was so many things. She was a collaborator, she was a statistician, she was a nurse, uh, she was a humanitarian. Florence Nightingale left many gifts to the world of nursing including a collection of 50 letters now on permanent exhibit at UAB School of Nursing. It's unique in that uh, these letters span a time in which little is known about Nightingale and a long period of time from 1853 to uh, 1893 when she was from age 33 to age 73 and a lot of these letters were written whenever she was bedridden, she was chronically ill, she reserved her strength to do these letters. It's, it is said that she, did, her family had to see her by appointment, so that is an interesting thing about her. But she knew that even after the Crimean War, she was not finished with, with her purpose. Lift high the royal banner, it shall not suffer loss. The royal banner of nursing, it should gain through every one of you. It has gained through you immensely. The old Romans were in some respects, I think, superior to us, but they had no idea of being good to the sick and weak. The knowledge that she needed to share on an international basis, uh, she felt driven to do this because she was what you would call an international correspondent. Uh, and she uh, shared so much with other people through her networking. Alabamian Dr. Lawrence Reynolds bought the letters in 1951 and donated most of them to UAB. The world needs to be able to see the letters, copies of the letters. Now, let's clarify that the original letters are being preserved and safeguarded at Reynolds Historical Library here at UAB. And we have copies of the letters that are in the Florence Nightingale display uh, at the School of Nursing. The interactive learning exhibit features reproductions and digital images of the letters housed on iPads for ease of reading. Students and faculty and others can use this information for research as a teaching tool, uh, just for little kids just to come see and learn about the founder of Modern Day Nursing. The exhibit was made possible by a generous gift from Barrett and Rick McKay, along with the Harry B. and Jane H. Brock Foundation. We honor Christ when we are good nurses. We dishonor Him when we are bad or careless nurses. We dishonor Him when we do not do our best to relieve suffering, even in the meanest creature. Students and faculty and others can use this information for research as a teaching tool, uh, just for little kids just to come see and learn about the founder of Modern Day Nursing.